probably have to finish talking to her and then we'll be able to finish off this scene. It's gonna take a group effort to move that ladder. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. I might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. There'll be thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. Anything over here? Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. Got any good ideas for getting through that, uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you gonna be able to hang in there? I have to. Allergies. Shit. People used to get those. I know, right? You never see anybody in an end-of-the-world story with pay fever. It's not the time to get wistful. I know. It's this deal with Clem. It's everything. It's put this rage inside me like I can't even say. I used to get allergies too, and just... Fuck. Who was that guy? Someone with priorities? I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We can't stop looking out for each other. You two have been solid since day one. What's this? Day three? Four? Well, I appreciate it. <laughs> I was very suspect of these guys when they first joined the group. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side of the hospital, it won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. All right. Now let's grab the ladder. Teamwork, people. Teamwork. Whoa, you need some help with that? I got it. No, I don't got it. What is going on? All right, walk to the bell tower. Damn it. Oh, shit. You can do it, Lee. The bells. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. I'll do it. Yeah, Ben will do it. <laughs> if we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Well, they could bite you in the balls, and then you'd have to chop off your balls. I'm just saying. It should be able to get me across the gap. I don't like anything about this. It'll take two seconds. <laughs> we'll keep it secure on our end. Uh, just don't let Ben touch the ladder, please. Go. Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time. Yep. Go. <laughs> oh dear Jesus. Dear God. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Jump, 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 ah! jump, 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 jump. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, man. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? Uh, there's my exit plan. I'll pre-open this it's if I can. Locked. Oh, shit. Shit, come on. The exit in here's locked! Got 
kidding me, man? A few solid rings of this, and there'll be thousands down below. All right, hope you got hops. Because here they come. Coming this way! Tons of them! Jesus! Now get back here! What's the plan for that? Tell me. I think I have to jump! There's no way back! You can make it! It ain't that far! <laughs> it's cause you're urban, right? You got this. You got this, motherfucker. I would at least run. There you go. Oh, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Oh, God. Uh, oh, stressful. Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof. <laughs> Don't give a fuck. <laughs> Holy... You gotta be shitty. What the fuck? There's a note. Come on! Just come the fuck on! Well, we're not coming back here after we find Clem. It's a guy on the radio! The one that's got Clem! They're gone! Holy shit! They're gone! Relax. Hey, guys? No. It wasn't the guy on the radio. It was Vernon. No fucking way! The invalids?! Their actions, uh, contradict your characterization, but, yeah, the invalids. He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their make-a-wish was a fucking boat ride! When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! I can't believe they did this to us. It's sick. It really is. They use your goddamn sympathy for sick folks and then stab us right in the back! They didn't use shit. They did what anybody would have done. They've been living like ghosts forever and they were fed up. That's it. He says he feels bad about it. Leaving us and Clementine behind. They fucked us! Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Yeah, chill out, Kenny. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Find a small town. Find a small town. Maybe one that hasn't been ripped up too bad. At some point, people are gonna have to start rebuilding. And you guys and Clem should be part of that. I don't know. Gotta have hope. We all do. Even you. Quit talking like you're already dead. Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill? 
Lee's bitten in God knows how long he has left, Clementine is who the fuck knows, and we're robbed of the only hope we've had. So? So Lee should have left your ass in Crawford. We got enough problems. Fuck you, Kenny! Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katja and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead! No! You know how they die. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive or dead or walkers or worse and I don't know. So give me a fucking break! Oh, Ben, I'm... Oh, oh shit! Here they come! In the house! See what your yelling did? That was nice for Ben to stand up for himself. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista! Get on the windows in the front room. Check the boards. Got it. Kenny! Weapons. Look for weapons. Gather anything you can find. Will do. Ben. Oh, God. Kill anything that gets in. You know you're talking to me, right? Ben, just do it! Omid! What is it? Oh. Front doors! Oh, my God! You son of a bitch, get back! No one gets to do the doghouse. Why did no one close Lee, the front doors? Help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Oh. Cut their arms off, you face it. Got it. I got it, Take guys. Cut goddamn arms off! Huh! Huh! Back off, bitches! Choppy, choppy. Now what? Get ready to fight. This place seems dirty to me. I think we're fine. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> dirty, she says. Sturdy my ass! Get upstairs! Go! I will defend. I will hold the line! Guys, help me with this! God damn it, Lee! He's only got one fucking arm. None of that's about to matter. This will slow him down. Get to the end of the hallway and take a fucking stand. 